life. How to protect yourself from a narcissistic individual. Protecting yourself from from narcissistic individual. You have to know that these people they are coming from a different teaching that we don't even think about. A narcissistic individual might have been trained right from when they are young. A narcissistic individual might have been taught when they are still very young, when they don't know that much of bad and good behavior of individuals. It's just like doctrines. They are giving this their doctrine right from, right from their young age. So, when you come across a narcissistic individual, and a narcissistic individual is a person that feels that feels that he own everything, all the whole world involved around them. A narcissistic individual is that person that thinks that he or she is better than everybody. Even though they might be going through a horrible situation, but they will still think that, no, get out of my face. I'm much more better than you. No, you can't help me. Get out. Get out of this place. You can't help me. All what I've got is better than what you have. Even though what you have can help them, they will say, no, no, this little that I have, this thing that I have is better than yours. Get out. Get out. That is an example of a narcissistic individual to, to you. A narcissistic individual, when you come across them, what you should first know is that they, are, they aren't hurting from their present situation where they made themselves or their present states where they are they are tapping they are tapping from past experience or past thoughts that have been given to them that have been taught to them like when i was in school my class teacher once told us that there was a book written it's called Scuola Universale. And in that book, it is written that it is written that white people are better than the remaining group of people on the whole planet. And they have more developed brain. They think more better than others. And letting you know, this book is not actually taught to students over here in Europe, when they are old. No. This book is given to them right from their very young age. Like from their primary one. From that, the word element, elementary in, in Latin word. Elementary. This book is being given to them. Those days. But I don't know about now. Maybe they are still teaching them in the primary school. But that book was being taught to them in school. Those days. That is, an, that is an example for you. And that example is more is more even higher because we all go to school and we and we have that mindset that whatever is being taught to us in school is the right thing and is fat. So many people grown up with this kind of mindset and with this kind of teachings. They can lead these individuals to have that narcissistic personality with them. 
That is it. So that is one of the things that you should know about in narcissistic individuals when you come across them. Let them know that you have come, you have seen a lot in life that you know what they are going through. And you have experienced their type of people before. Especially if you are in Europe, this will be, this will be very helpful, helpful for you. Or if you are not in your hometown, when you are not in your hometown, you are in, in another place. Let them know that you have come across this kind of behavior. This will actually cool them down. This will let them know that, okay, this person have come across an individual like me that have this kind of my narcissistic mindset and personality. So let them know that you have come across them. You have come across their type before. And another thing we should know about narcissistic individuals is that we should make them know that this thing that they are talking about or this is their thought process. It's not them. It's not them actually. It's the program that I've been given to them. It's the program from the TV, that is television program. And that is what they are teaching them, different, propaganda, uh, different propaganda out there on the media. Like the ones being taught, being showed in media that Children in Africa, all children in Africa are suffering. They don't have a uh, shoe to wear on their feet. They are, they are walking foot naked. They are walking naked on the street. That their eyes are full of flies. That is part of it. All those um, adverts, those are people that are just trying to make money. It is always more shown on the social media, the more. Not on TV again, self. It's being shown more on social media that come and contribute, come and help the children, come and help the children. But this is actually them, those people, they are, trying, they, they are just trying to make money. They are trying to make money through the innocent people that have that kind heart to want to help the poor. But if this continue, what are those money that they have been helping that they have been collecting from people these years done for them? At least by now, those money should have helped them to create or to build something that they can be financing themselves now. But they keep on still continue asking that save, save these children, save these children. Whereas they are spoiling other people's images and they are like that, they are confirming and validating the things that those narcissistic people have in their head that these are, this is how these people are, this is, these people that don't look like me, they look like this, they are, they are coming from jungle. Me too, along my experience, I had the experience that people thought that because I'm, I'm like those people that do, that they do show on the TV or on the social media that they are poor, they are living in jungle. I actually come across people like that. I actually think that I'm from Gongu, where I'm from Jungu. They ask me where where's my house? That did I don't live on trees? Something like that. That did I see monkey and uh, gorilla and lion and, and chipazin, tiger, antelope around me? Where, where 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 was I living before I came here? I let them know that this is all TV program but i don't i didn't actually have the courage to tell them this before but i gained courage me knowing myself me getting to knowledge i tried to tell them more that see what they are going through it's not it's not them this is not you this is not you they are programming to be like this and this actually make them to really see me that okay this person is he might just be saying the truth. The media, the, the social media, they are feeding them to hate others, not looking like them. There's more to be said on this. We'll speak later. Peace. The good life.